Hello everyone, welcome to Topaz. A quick reminder to stay in the room for the duration of class, allowing your body to acclimate to the temperature. Today we're going to begin with a quick breathing exercise. Coming to the top of your mat, feet together, toes and angles touching, palms facing the back of the room. Exhale, tuck your chin to your chest. And inhale your arms up, lengthening through your spine. Exhale, release your arms back down. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, last one, inhale, exhale, second set, this time making full circles with your arms on your exhale, inhale your arms up, lengthen through your spine, suck your stomach in, exhale, releasing your head, neck back, flipping your hands at the bottom. Tuck your chin to your chest. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, last one. Exhale. Release. For half moves, feet together, toes and ankles touching at the center of your mat. Inhale your arms up. Interlacing all 10 fingers, releasing your index finger. Inhale, lengthen through your spine. Exhale, bump your hips to the left, rounding to the right. Keeping your hips and chest square to the front of the room. Chest up, chin up. Squeeze your palms together, keeping your arms by your ears. Shoulders back and down. Sinking one more inch for the last five, four, three, two, one. Back up to center. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, bump your hips to the right, rounding to the left. Keeping your shoulders back and down. Feet firmly planted into the mat. Hips square to the front of the room. Keeping your chin up, gaze forward. Engaging your core, breathing through your nose and out your nose. Sink a little deeper for the last five, four, three, two, one. Back to center. Inhale, lengthen for deep back bend. Exhale, press your hips forward, releasing your head, neck back, bring your arms with you. Keep your eyes open and your mouth shut. Going a little bit deeper, sinking one more inch for the last three, two, one, engage your abs, come back up to center. For a forward fold, inhale, lengthen up, pump your hips back, folding forward, slowly with a flat back. Once you, release, once you reach the mat, release your hands. Reaching for up to elbows, getting a deep stretch in your hamstrings, pedaling out your feet, 
squatting down through both knees, getting loose here. Stepping in alternate fingers with your thumbs on the outside, wrapping your forearms around your calves. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, pull. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, pull. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, pull. Release your arms overhead, interlacing your fingers again, releasing your index finger. Straightening your arms and coming back up with a flat back, engaging your core, back to center. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, your arms by your side. Going into our awkward series for awkward one, feet together, toes and ankles touching. Inhale, your arms up overhead, palms facing, and sit back with your shoulders back and down into the chair, squeezing your inner thighs together, gazing through your fingertips, focusing on a point out in front of you. Holding here. Thinking a little bit deeper. Chest up, chin up. Sinking one more wrench for the last. Three, two, one. Pressing back up to center. Exhale your arms out parallel in front of you. Separating your feet hip width distance and slowly sitting back in the imaginary chair. Your chest up, chin up, shoulders back and down for upper two. Holding here. Keeping the weight in your heels, lifting all ten toes off the mat. Sinking one more inch for the last five. Four, three, two, one. Press back up, keeping your arms where they are, coming up high onto all 10 toes, and slowly lower back down, lowering your spine as if you're lowering it down the back wall. Holding here, coming up higher on your, onto your toes, the lower you go. Slowly lowering another inch. Going to our max here for the last five, four, three, two, one. Pressing back up to the center. Exhale your arms by your side. For eagle, coming to the center of our mat, feet together, toes and ankles touching. Inhale your arms up, palms touch. Exhale, swing your right arm under your left arm, interlacing your arms like rope and sitting back into the chair. Keeping your shoulders back and down, but your elbows lifted. Once you have your balance, keeping the weight in your heels, you can lift up your right leg high and over your left leg, wrapping your toes around your left calf. Holding here. Making sure to keep your chest up, your chin up, your elbows and your knees in a perfect line. Sinking another inch for the last five, four, three, Two, one, press back up, inhale your arms up, palms touch, exhale swing your left arm under your right arm, interlacing your arms like rope, sitting back into the imaginary chair, keeping your chest up, chin up, shoulders back and down, elbows lifted. Once you have your balance, lift up your left leg and wrap it around your right calf, interlacing your leg, your toes around your calf, holding here. Keep your elbows lifted. Knees and elbows in a line. Going to your max for the last five, four, three, two, one. Press back up to center. Inhale your arms up, palms touch. Exhale, arms by your side. Take a quick minute to wipe your eyes and grab a quick sip of water. Coming back to our mats for our balancing series, starting with strong, strong wind relieving, coming to the center of our mat, feet together, toes and ankles touching, 
Shifting our weight to our left leg, lifting up at our right knee, parallel, placing our right hand on our thigh, holding here. With our toes flex back, chest up, chin up, standing leg straight and strong. Holding here. Lift up just another inch. Not putting any force on your hand, but pressing your thigh up into your hand. Going to your max for the last five, four, three, two, one. Lower your legs. Shift your weight into your right foot, lifting up at your left knee, placing your left hand on your thigh, curling your toes back towards your face. Chest lifted. Shoulders back and down. Standing legs straight and strong, holding here. Not putting any weight on your hand, but pressing your thigh up into your hand. Pressing up another inch. Lifting up through our spine as if somebody has a string attached to our head, pulling us up. Pressing to our max for the last five, four, three, two, one. Lower your leg back down to the mat. For standing forehead to knee, shifting our weight back into our left leg, lifting up our right knee, interlacing our hands, our fingers underneath our right foot, and kicking our heel out. Once we have our balance, lowering our forehead down to our knee, holding here. Ultimately, the goal is to wrap your forearms under your calf in, in standing forehead to knee, holding here. If you fall out, you have plenty of time to get right back into it, keeping your standing legs straight and strong, maintaining balance. Holding here for the last five, four, three, Two, one, lower your right leg back to the mat. Shifting your weight into your right foot, lifting up at your left knee, interlacing all 10 fingers under your left foot and kicking your heel out. Once you have your balance, go ahead and lower your forehead down to your knee or to your shin. Holding here. Firmly planting your feet into the mat, allowing you to gain balance, keeping your right leg straight and strong. Trying to fully wrap your forearms under your calf. Holding here for the last five, four, three, two, one. Release. Standing bow, shifting our weight back into our left leg. Placing our right elbow to our side, opening up our palm to the right side of the room, reaching back for our right foot, inhaling our arm up above our head and pivoting at our waist, kicking our right foot back into our hand. Holding here. Keeping your shaming leg straight and strong. The higher you kick your foot into your hand, the further forward you will fold. Holding here. If you fall out, get right back into it. Holding here for a few more seconds. Three, two, one. Release back to the mat. Shift your weight into your right foot. Placing your left elbow to your side with your palm facing the side of the room. Reaching back for your left foot. Inhale your right arm up. Exhale. Slowly kick your left leg back into your hand. Shifting your weight forward. Holding here. Trying to kick our left heel high up into our hand. Back and up towards the ceiling. Keeping our shoulder and our elbow and our foot in line. 
trying to keep our body square to the mat and to the floor. Release back to center. Exhale your arms back down by your side. Balancing stick coming to the backs of our mat. Inhale our arms up. Palms touch, interlacing all ten fingers. Releasing your index finger. With your right leg, just taking a big step towards the center of your mat. Pivoting at the waist and making a capital T shape with your body. Kicking your left leg back towards the back room. Holding here. Keeping our standing leg straight and strong. Our hips and chest square to the floor. Making a perfect line to, from our hands to our toes. Put it here for the last three, two, one. Step back. Inhale, lengthen up. Exhale, step your left leg forward, pivoting at the waist. Kicking your right foot back, creating a capital T shape with your body. Keeping your arms by your ear, extend it overhead. Your hips and chest square to the mat. Holding here for the last few seconds. Three, two, one. Exhale, step back. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, release your arms by your side. Stepping to the top of your mat for triangle, taking a quarter turn to the right. Inhale, your arms up, palms touch. Exhale, step four feet across your mat. Exhale, your arms parallel to the mat. Turning your right toes towards the back of the room and slightly turning in your left toes. Dropping your right hand to your right knee, lengthening up through your left fingertips, sinking deep in the lunge for triangle. Holding here. Making sure to keep your chest and chin lifted, sinking deeper into the lunge on the right side. Lengthening through your fingertips, on the, uh, your left fingertips, gazing up towards your fingertips. Sinking deeper into the lunge. Holding here for the last three, two, one. Press back up to center, arms parallel. Turning our right toes pigeon toed and turning our left toes towards the front of the room. Sinking deep in the lunge, dropping our left hand to our left knee, opening up our chest and our hips to the right side of the room. Holding here, lengthening up through our right fingertips. Making sure our back leg is straight and strong, sinking deeper into our lunge on the left side. Chest up, chin up. Sinking one more inch for the last three, Two, one, press back up to center, arms parallel, inhale your arms up overhead, exhale, release your arms by your side. Inhale your arms up overhead, exhale your arms parallel, stepping across your mat. For wide, wide legged forward fold, staying here and uh, bumping your hips back, uh, bending, folding it, folding forward. And once you reach the mat, you can release your hands, swaying right and left, allowing your hamstrings to loosen up a little bit, reaching for the right side, reaching for the left side, keeping your legs straight, feeling a deep stretch in your hamstrings here. Reaching for the outsides of your feet, stepping on all ten fingers. Inhale, lengthen through your spine. Exhale, pull your, your, the crown of your head towards the mat. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, pull. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, pull. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, pull. Release your arm parallel by your side. And slowly engage your core and come up with a flat back. Inhale your arms up overhead. Lengthen, release your arms by your side. Coming to the center of your mat for tree. Feet together, toes and ankles touching. Shifting the weight into your left leg. Lifting up at your right foot. 
up towards your hip crease on your thigh or on your calf, bringing your left hand to heart center for tree. Keeping our hips forward and our right knee pointed down. Hips and chest square to the front of the room. Standing leg straight and strong. Engaging our core. Holding here for the last five, four, three, two, one, release. So if you weight to your right leg, lifting up at your left foot to your hip crease or your upper thigh or your calf. Raising your right hand to heart center. Holding here. Keeping your hips forward, chest up, chin up. Lengthening through your spine. Keeping your core engaged, holding balance. Holding here for the last five, four, three, two, one, release. Lying on your backs for Shavasana. Feet together, toes flared out, palms facing up. Inhale through your nose. Exhale out of your nose. 